Hi there, welcome back. It's Karen Jean. And if you saw my last video, yes, one of the overhead light bulbs had blown out. So yeah, so we are a little bit brighter, thankfully. Um, so yeah, so these two journaling cards are done. I just put that on off camera. So those are done. Very nice. Very nice. Um, so other things we can do, we need more pockets, I think. And I want to add some kind of, you know, interest, interest along the way. I'm going to come back to these right here. Um, actually, they're the blue and the pink are not. They're, they're good colors for this journal. So, one thing we can do is, well, no, there's a butterfly there. Let's decorate that a little bit. Uh, here is the signature center. We can make it like we can put a piece of washi tape down here and that could be a flip out. That's what I'm thinking. Or build this up a little bit. Um, we have our two pockets here. One, two. We need to make journaling cards. We need to make clusters. Okay. I don't know. No, we could just put those in as a little gift. They could decorate them, put them wherever they want. Whoever gets the journal. Right, right. So right, so right, so right. Yeah, we could put one there. Let's put one there. Whoops. No, I don't want that. Let's see if I can get it the backing off. There we go. There. So it's at interest, but it's flat. So it's very nice. This is cardstock. So we should build up on this. We don't want this cardstock to go to waste. We don't, we don't. What am I going to do with these? I can, I really like it. It's very pretty. I think it's pretty. I think it's pretty. Uh, let me get a piece of book page and let's do a little, a little practice fun here. So here we have a piece of book page, which is about the size of what these papers are, truth be told. So there is, we, the thing is, it's not double-sided paper. So to do something like this, actually, that would have one, two, three, four. And we'd want that like this. Let's see. Uh, yep, yeah, needs to be over just a little bit. I'm probably going to trim that down. Then we folded this in like so. And I would cut that down. Or should I have folded it further? Like, so? no, that's fine. I was thinking maybe having that come off the edge, but that's fine. And I want to cut that down. Uh, how big is this? This is an inch. 
Okay, let's make that an inch. Oh, get that out of there. Let's make that right there an inch. And I'll use, use my little one here. Let's see how that fits. It comes off the edge a little. I'm gonna sneeze. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. So, all right, let me trim that down just a little bit more. Oof, 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 oof. Let's get it there, let's get it. Uh, let's get it there. Let's turn it down. Come on. Let's see if we can get it straight. Okay, that should be enough. Oh, it's very warm up here. It is the afternoon and we do have the excessive heat warnings until tomorrow night. So there's that. So, there. Okay, I need to... What do I need to do? How am I going to do this? I could glue it here, or I could washi tape it in. I will glue it along, oof. Oh, well, that's not good. Let's see if I get that silicone top off. Uh, there, there, here. So along there, and along here. Put that in, and then for this, put that down. Mm. Okay, there. There. And we have ein, zwei, drei, vier. Very nice. Very nice indeed, if I do say so myself. I'm going to put those. I don't want to lose them. Oh, for heaven's sakes. Okay, so we have that there. And this. Actually, I want to build it up a little bit more. Um, or we could do something like that on top of it. That one won't work, but that and that. So that's a tough spot. We could just put it over here. I'm not sure anybody would realize. Let's see. Um, we put the green on it. And there's no gummed edges on this, so. Look at that, we made a little bit of mud. That's okie dokie. this one on this way 
flips out that way and this one flips out that way. Okay, why don't we do that? We still need to find washi tape. I'll be right back. Okay, I have some washi tape pulled out here. I have this one, which is flamingos. Flamingos are nowhere on or in this paper, but you know, I don't know. This is also flamingos. This one came from the Dollar Tree. This one came with a pack that I have. This and this is just white with the green and I might use these actually. I have this pink gridded washi tape. We could use that, maybe, I don't know. Maybe we could double those up. And this one I just recently got, it came with a pack of, I'm trying to find the end and I can't, there it is. Came with a pack of fruits. I was looking for washi that had like watermelon and lemons and stuff. So it came in a pack and this has pears, pineapples, pomegranates, um, pretty colors, but again, I'm not too sure. And with these polka dots here, although I do have polka dotted washi as well, I think what we're going to do is, I don't know, should we use the pink grid on this? Just use this. I also have these tapes which are thick, they can be trimmed down. Uh, this one, which is basically colored masking tape. Why don't we try this one first? Okay, so this, hold on. Let's move the book over a little bit. So we're gonna do this one here. I don't know why this is so difficult for me. All right, I'm going to use, I'm gonna use the this. Gonna trim it down. I'm going to also, I'm going to get out the glue stick and run it along the top of the glue because as we know washi tape is not meant to be permanent it's meant to be removable and there oh, for heaven's sakes there hmm, kind of disappears which I rather like. I might also just do an extra little piece on this side to give it an extra little more reinforcing. So, I hope you all are staying cool and that your air conditioners have not broken, that you have air conditioning. No, it's a first world problem, but I'm very thankful for it. Um, I think I told you we had our air conditioner. I feel like it just caught something, sorry. Um, uh, this pink is just a little bit too plain for me. Hold on, let me think. Or all the own rubber stamps. So, I don't think that's, we could do that. Confidential, confidential. Get that inked up, get a wipe. And let's see. Well, let's just be careful not to, let's just be careful not to rock it. Also, I'm feeling I need something on this page. We have this here. Need to decorate these pages somehow. Need to 
stencils. All right, I will, thinking, um, no, this one's going this way. This one's going out this way. I'm taping it over here. All right, I need to, uh, where are all my, where are all my, here are my clips. I need to clip this down. Okay, so this one's going to be taped on this side, and we will use well, let's use let's use a little bit of both. Nope, not the pink. Nope, we'll just use this one. down. Oh. There we go. Throw it through the glue. Put it where we want it. Right there. Right there. Actually, that's pretty gosh darn good length I cut without even, without even looking at it. And this side, I think I'll just use this because I think it'll just disappear kind of into the background. I do want to reinforce it, which is why I'm doing this. My glue is kind of soft. It's that hot up here. And there. Well, I should have moved it over a little bit more. That is okay. It's coming off the page just a hair. That's what happens when you fly by the seat of your pants. It's what happens. It's what happens. Okay. Kaboom. And we could actually do that with some page flip outs too. Like this one. This I wanted to. Oh, let's just tone on tone. We could put it up there, kind of break that up a little bit. Why don't we do that? Let's see if I can get the backing off of it. There it goes. Just to break that up a little bit. Whoops. Get that, this little tail glued down again. There, whoops. There. Okay. So we could fold this up, right? Fold it up once, like this. I haven't made these in a while. Fold it up twice. Fold it up three times. Let's see if it'll go up four. No, let's fold it up three times. And we're gonna cut this down just a little bit like that. We're gonna fold these in like so. Right, if I can. fold it down and there is like a little envelope that becomes a journaling spot and what we can do is put a piece of string or ribbon probably would be better the string is a little bit too bumpity bumps you could even put it here on top of a belly band. <laughs> that would be fun. It keeps on. There's a problem here. There. If I do it that way. And let's get a piece of 
ribbon. All right, let's just go for gold. Fix is exploding everywhere, probably because I store it upside down. And what I'm doing here is I'm just placing a plastic little butterfly on top of that flap so that the ribbon has something to grab onto to tie it, otherwise the flap was constantly coming off. And that's the end of this one. Well, I really appreciate you spending your time with me. I hope you're enjoying this journal as much as I am. There we have our cute little finished product. This is Karen G from Ex Libra's Crafts. We're only limited by our own imaginations, but yours run wild. Thanks for stopping by.